Good morning guys, long time no see and welcome to today's vlog. I haven't put up videos in a few days. It was a week's gap with my video uploads and that's because I worked a little bit for Fatser last week and I didn't really feel like I had time or the energy to edit my videos and stuff when I got home. But this week I'm not working for Fatser so I'll just be putting up videos. We just be putting up videos. Right Rascal? Videos. These two guys want to go outside and walk. I'm just gonna have a glass of water before we go walk. Remember kids, it's important to stay hydrated when it's warm. It's been like super nice weather here in Sweden for two weeks or something now. It's getting warmer and warmer. So warm that I can go out with t-shirt and shorts in the morning at 7 o'clock. One unfortunate thing though is that pollen is also going around now. I'm taking my pollen medicine but I can still, I still get kind of irritated by the pollen, like itchy and sneezy and runny. So that stuff kind of sucks, but at least the weather is nice. Sniff man, come on. So what's going on today? I'm going to spend most of the morning, I'm, I'm, I think, on editing a video. And that video should be up before this one, so that would be when Cat trims and cuts my beard. And this time she got some extra help from a certain tool. But you should go check it out if you haven't. We're also going to Grandma later. And we're bringing Rascal and Menace. We're gonna eat a little bit. Just me, Cat and Grandma. I think I'm gonna bring you there so you can see my Grandma's house a little bit. She's a very nice old lady. It feels like giving them their breakfast. Something that I've been showing in my vlog maybe <laughs> like 25 times or like in every vlog I've ever posted. Just tell me if you're tired of it, right? Just say that Sunny enough with the dog breakfast. Do you think it's enough with the dog breakfast, guys? I don't know. <clears throat> you like showing how patient you are? Go ahead, Rascal. Go ahead, Menace. Go ahead. Go ahead. I'm gonna put on some coffee, then I'm gonna sit down to edit. We have the door open most of the day, so... There's a bunch of leaves and stuff that blow in here. So I just need to vacuum those up because they're all over the living room. And who's there? I don't care. Oh. How come you've been such an early bird these latest day? I don't really have trust. Why? Well, I'm awake, I'm awake. Yeah, but isn't it nice? Be up with the bird, up with the top, up with the rooster. In Sweden we are saying that when you're awake early, you call it to be up with the rooster. So cat, are you up with the rooster? But I think roosters are up for it. Yeah, but they're not Roosters go up at seven. Okay. Everyone knows that. Come on, where's your rooster knowledge, cat? Say goodbye, Christmas. Can I have some butter breakfast? Yeah, I'll have some butter breakfast. The hill. Where's going, man? Is you've already had your breakfast. Leave mommy alone. So I've been editing for a bunch of hours now. We're getting towards the end, but I'm gonna have to take a break because we're going to dinner or lunch rather at the grandma's now. So we have to prepare the puppies and get it going. Do we have two puppies that are ready for grandma visit? Are you ready, Menace? <laughs> he just put his mouth around the camera and then realized it was not food and he moved away. What the hell? Dude. Let's get going, guys. I'm gonna be rocking my Majanus. Majanus? My ma... 
Manjanas. Not man manjanas. There's no D in manjanas. I didn't say D. Yeah, it's in manjanas. It's about That's what made it sound like vaginas. There's no D in vagina either. No, <laughs> a, a G. Yeah, but a G in a vagina. Did you didn't you hear what I said? There's no D in vagina. What do you mean that? Why is that so sexist? Racist. These in vaginas, that's how babies are born, cat. Oh, what the fuck am I doing? Today I'm not driving. Driving? Driving, even. Um, cat's driving, and that means I can vlog freely. Are the puppies backseat driving? Yes. Yes? I just like carrying this around more, but this is smell. I usually have it in my pocket. Yeah, you have. I mean, if I, a girl, have big enough pockets <laughs> on my clothing to have the other camera in there, you, a boy, do too. I'm glad that you stated our genders to be w more specific. Yes, because women clothing has this small pockets. Well, I feel like. Me, a boy, have other stuff in my pockets as well, like keys and cell phone and cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so old, no. <laughs> and you, a girl, maybe just put this in your back pocket. I don't have back pockets in these uh, shorts, so thank you for this conversation, girl. That's how much you, a boy, value your viewers and the quality they get to watch. Like Guys, do you think this is bad quality? The question is from me, a boy. <laughs> God the hell. <laughs> Now I'm just standing here outside my dad's work because I'm picking him up and he's getting the car and he's gonna drop me off at home. Cat and the dogs walked off at home before so the dogs could go in and have their food and some water they needed that. I'm gonna finish the editing of the beard cutting video then I'm just gonna post that and pretty much not too long after that it's time for football practice. Also by the way grandma food is always good. It's like she always makes these old traditional Swedish meals. In Sweden we call that husmanskost. It's the kind of food that like back in the day they probably ate this like four times a week. Meals like that are called husmanskost and there's a few traditional examples. But today we ate potatoes with meat and uh, brown sauce as we call it here. A bunch of different vegetables to that. I do really enjoy husmanskost because that's not something we cook often at all. When you go to grandma's place, either grandma's place, then you usually get some husmanskost and it's always nice when you don't eat it that often. If you want some examples of this, just google Swedish husmanskost and you'll probably get some, some good pictures or links to a list of good husmanskost. Tomorrow I'm gonna go into lean shopping. Um, and I'm gonna go to Egga's place, the drummer of Ariat Summit. And if you didn't already know this, we have a side project, um, another band that is a side project that's called Faith Breaker. We've written four songs that we, uh, that we want to have for an EP. This whole process goes very slow, like it's just, since it's a side project, we just do it in the time that we have off, so um, every step takes, takes a long time. But tomorrow we're gonna go in and record hopefully two songs of lyrics 
and I'm gonna vlog that as well. So all you get to come along if you want to see it. Look, Kika. Yeah. What are you doing? Okay. Is this okay content, or are you too naked? No, I'm wearing bikini. That's okay. Yeah. Oh, what a nice cap you have there. Yeah. Where might you have gotten that from? Were you just pointing? <laughs> That's not a point. What are you doing? That's a duck. So now I'm gonna go back and continue with the editing so I can get that video up and done, up and going. Well, the reason I'm sitting in a, this dark room is because I'm gonna play one game of Dota before I go to football practice. So. That's all the time I have now. I'm done with the video and the video just got uploaded. My reward is one Dota game. And we better win. So, we won. I played Spirit Breaker, had a great game. We were losing in the beginning and then we won. So, now I'm gonna go away to practice football. Hello guys. As usual, I forgot to vlog when I got home from practice. As usual as well. All that happens when I get home is that I eat something, I sit down in front of the computer for a little while and then I go to bed because I'm so tired. But anyway, this will now be the end of this vlog. I've just been out with the puppies. I went to the doctor, the puppies has been fed, my breakfast and coffee and all, everything is here. So now I'm gonna start editing this vlog. I have to say goodbye first, so... Thanks for watching guys, hope you have a sunny fucking day.